she's his handler and that the whole situation is not all that it seems to be okay so apparently they are also saying that it is being rumored allegedly that Sidem is his handler and she's also a witch that has been sent to finish him off essentially so let me know in the comments what you guys think about this whole situation because I was traveling in the spirit and ended up in Jamaica I came across a grave when I came across the grave and look inside the grave I saw cartel ladies and gentlemen this is the man I saw in the grave <clears throat> My Sokobalingriana. This is a man that I saw in the grave. The real vibes cartel. You hear me? The real vibes cartel. I said to him, sir, what are you doing here? He said, Amari, I died nine months ago. Cartel. Are you cloned? If I'm cloned, yeah, the real cartel, I fuck our mother. This is the clone. Maybe that's why I'm a clone. Okay, boom, viewers, welcome back to the channel. Subscribers, you already know the thing's set. We're blessed. Hope you're having a wonderful day today. But just a few trending topics, Miss It Popping dance all that we need to discuss not in any particular order so let's watch at the end of the video so you don't miss that thing obviously we want to kick it off a dance all king vibes cartel cause you can see he addressed um being a clone <laughs> and not a clone you know what i mean put in the comment section where you think about that obviously there's a lot of people um on social media um um, I didn't know there was so much people talking about this. You see, I said, so let's hear what the first lady is saying, and then we'll get to dance our Queen Amari is in it. And as usual, I'll tell you if I agree or I disagree with them at the end. She's his handler, and that the whole situation is not all that it seems to be. Okay? Apparently, there's a whole lot of sinister, sinister things going on um, that we don't know about. Um, the powers that be are in charge and this is all a whole facade now that i didn't say that I, I didn't say that's my opinion okay but i'm telling you what i'm hearing now there's also even a prophetess that has been weighing in on his life and saying that his life is in danger because he's he's this she doesn't believe that she believes that this is vibes cartel right her name is uh okay so she says that he is the real vibes cartel that came out of prison but others are saying no he's a clone because of his graves disease okay now because of his bulgy eyes and the puffiness of his face and his you know really enlarged um abdomen tummy area there and the small very tiny hands and tiny feet there you know some people are even saying that you know all kinds of derogatory things about him but anyway also they are saying that um, the prophet is saying that she's saying that he went anyhow him leave Jamaica and takes the plane that he when he comes back if he leaves for treatment and then when goes to a foreign country for treatment when he comes back he will not be the same same vibes cartel apparently they are planning to clone him and she says it's not really a clone it's a reptilian that will be taking over his body sort of like Beyonce because you know he's very powerful and she's saying that he's high in um, the dark world or the dark realm he's powerful in that he's lieutenant in the dark world okay I don't know anything about that guys I'm just the messenger here okay so apparently they're also saying that it is being rumored allegedly that Sidem is his handler and she's also a witch that has been sent to finish him off essentially so let me know in the comments what you guys think about this whole situation because I think the guy is just sick you know I just think he's sick and he's he's really trying to take care of it so that he can go off you know he can come back out on the stage and do what he is meant to do um, as for his his 
uh, as for Sidem, I don't know. I don't know what is going on with her. It is really kind of strange because to me, she doesn't really look like his usual type. But who knows? Maybe she was his type all along. I don't know. A lot is being said, guys. A lot is being said. Also, guys, I watched a video the other day of um, when um, Sean Storm was having his interview with the lawyer, Isat Buchanan. And Vibes Cartel had attended that interview. He was there, you know. And apparently, uh, Vibes Cartel, I heard him saying some things. He had another guy there beside him and that apparently was in prison too. And he said that um, Isaac Buchanan's um, house, basically he believes it was built from his money because Isaac took a lot of millions off of him to help to, you know, to get him out of prison and even the vehicle that he's driving and that Isaac Buchanan money tall. So guys, let me know in the comments what you think about that. As a matter of fact, I needed to say, I forgot to say, that it was another mess up. It was another little fumble because Vibes did not understand that Isaac could hear him on the live because Isaac had his, his TikTok live on. So he could hear everything he was saying. And Vibes kept saying it over and over. And then Vibes, really, it wasn't a joke. Isaac kept laughing, but Vibes was not laughing. He was really serious and he kept asking, when they think you can hear me, can you hear me? He definitely could hear him but a world boss him say when wants and him say when feels so okay people and this is why i don't be listening to these false prophets out here you see my saying it's not everybody that can be a messenger like me um those of you who's following me already know we dispel all of those claims that you know these people is saying people is making because they're not trying to take the blame for their opinions and those of you that's new to the channel, these are the specific videos for owner for the watch to see us providing proof Vibes Cartel transferred his properties out of name because I never want Liz and forget nothing if him get convicted. You see what I'm saying? Um, so there's no money and royalties um, for Sidem because his record label and publishing and everything will go to him too bigger on them. You see what I'm saying? If you don't know anything about bank account, which many of you don't, you always put a beneficiary upon it. And we know it's not short because she only had the power of attorney for one year. You see me, I see my people put in the comment section where you think about that. Because let's be honest, Vibes Cartel said it. You know, when he was locked up, him baby mother, I worry about him money, but him not dead yet. You see me, I say, um, if you listen to Shorty, she says she never business about all the other concubines then because she's the boss. <laughs> she gets all the money. You feel me? So, I don't look like Sidem is about the money. Sidem look like she's about the ring. You know what I mean? And she now play with Vibes Cartel. You see my, see my peeps. And that's why she's, you know, latch on to him everywhere I'm go. And now let him go. You see my, see, and bugging him about the wedding because that's all they talked about for the last 10 years. I know that he's free. You know, that man a whole up. You see my, see. Uh, you know, I'm a itch panny thing, you see me. If you don't believe me, let's take a quick look before we get to dance at Empress Amari. Ask him when the wedding is. I don't know. June weddings are the best. June? So I've got to wait another year. Or would you like to? No, if it's up to me, we'll do it tomorrow. Do you want to do it tomorrow? No, we can't do it tomorrow. Tomorrow we'll be on a plane. Oh, so it's not me. The video live? Okay, yeah, yeah, but tomorrow it can't oh, be. Yeah. Literally, so if right? it can't be tomorrow, could it be Thursday, the next day? What? Could it be the next day? Thursday? Yeah, well, we They're have to go do it. when's the wedding? Exactly. Someone said she's upset. Yes, she is. I'm not upset. I'm telling I'm, you, she's upset. And because she's high, I'm drinking. She drink rum and she don't drink people. Now she drinking rum and coke, Hennessy and coke, Dom Perian, tequila. tequila shots, I'm Moet. Falling. She drank everything except water. <laughs> the fuck? I do drink water. <laughs> she drank one cork of water. She took a shot of water, like. No piano man. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Thank you, Chloe. What's the question? Who was asking the question? When are we getting married? Mina Sidat. Right, that. Whoever that was, ask me the question. Whoever was asking, it wasn't one person. Ask me the question. Somebody said, Get some watermelon. Yeah, she got watermelon. Watermelon Look, vape. When are you getting married? When is the wedding? This is what I'm saying. The people are asking. It's when is the me. wedding? I never certified. All right, certified Ruby. So, when is the wedding? When you get married. Soon, you know you were waiting him to say. What, what him name? What, what month is soon? People right now, believe me, she first. She a drink liquor, yeah. Yeah, she a, she a drink liquor left, right and centre. And she does a take me on. Don't worry about it. She me take some picture yesterday with some girl. But me and I'm with her, so we have to... Why am I going to care about groupies? She cares, and I tell her, don't care, bro. It's the life of an artist. As I I'm say, not acting... Like I'm a connoisseur. Look, people are saying when you're getting married. You think Hold you on. I've been it's seeing the life. Questions. Hold on. Let me talk to the nation. Wait, let's put a drink behind it. No, because don't put nothing here. You yeah, think yeah, yeah. it was me asking. You see, that proves my theory why people believe Sidem is a possessed witch. You know, I mean, they are using some other words for her. You <laughs> said, that's not too nice. Um, but as you can see, this is what they talked about for the past 10 years. And the reason why Vibes Cartel may be itching is because, you know, when you get married, um, it's forever, you know what I mean? And you don't really know somebody um, when they're locked up, you see me, uh, and vice versa, you see me. So now that they're free, they're able to see, you know, each other's flaws and what them like and don't like. And if they want to make that decision, you see me, uh, but it don't look like... Sidem is giving any groupies or any potential new concubines any crumbs to eat. Let's proceed with the next. To many as a comedian, a stupid person, but little did they know that I'm a woman with a lot of wisdom. <laughs> and I look and I saw where Jamaicans' eyes were open up and they realize that they have been told a lie. A couple years ago, there was a video circulating that people claim that the individuals in the video was Jay-Z and Beyonce. I came online and I informed my fans that that is not Jay-Z and Beyonce. It was heard all over the globe how Jay-Z and Beyonce were in Jamaica. They came to find out that it was a lie. But when Amari say something, you know, it's like nobody really cares to listen. Yet, is the, yet Amari is the one who caused people around here to be bold. But when somebody finally come out with it, they make it seem as if they are the ones who originally said it, and they get all the glory. But my God will get the glory in this instance. Masaka Balingrion. Ever since I was a child, I was born with a gift. I walked and talked with the true and living God. I'm not talking about regular prayers. He walked with me and he talked with me and he showed me everything. Ladies and gentlemen, I said the story before and I say it again. I was traveling in the spirit and ended up in Jamaica. I came across a grave. When I came across the grave and looked inside the grave, I saw cartel. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the man I saw in the grave. <clears throat> My Soko Balingriana. This is the man that I saw in the grave. The real vibes cartel. You hear me? The real vibes cartel. I said to him, sir, what are you doing here? 
He said, Amari, I died nine months ago. Then he said to me, I would have liked if my body was carried throughout the streets of Jamaica with people on both sides, but it did not happen. He said, Amari, I trust you, and I'm handing you the torch to carry on where I left off. Vibes Cartel. Ladies and gentlemen, have you been looking at Vibes Cartel lately? Before the show is over, I'm going to tell you who you have been looking, looking at all this time. So like and share this one. Mm -hmm. Yes, get the numbers up and I may tell you if the numbers look fine. Because I want to make sure that the bloggers run with this one. Because if Jamaica do not deal with this, I'm going to take it on an international platform. And then Jamaica going to look bad. Real, 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 real bad. Because they're not going to say it's one of us is a thief. They're going to say, all are we a thief, all are we a liar. Yeah? Like and share this one. Let me tell you who this man is, because he's about to shit up and piss up himself, because there is no way that Amari DJ Mona Lisa should know this, because the five people who are really involved, they are closely connected, and everybody get a good portion of money, so there is no reason why none of them should tell on themselves Eh? Because not even their wives. Nowadays, they don't even have wives. The five people who are involved in this criminal activity, they have women. <laughs> Truly, I'm a prophetess of the true and living God. And I tell you this day that Jamaica, they have not released to you Vibes Cartel. Matakabalingrio <laughs> Kopale. Vesha kapali, nukubalingria kapalingria kapale. No. 13 years from that, that is that cartel you're looking at. And 13 years later, coming out of jail, we were informed that he has a heart problem. So when we saw this man come out looking a little swollen, we said, all right, in fear soon go down. In body soon go down. And soon we'll see cartel. Yes, bitch. Take off your handkerchief. Take off your eyeglass and face me because I shall bring you to shame and disgrace. I don't need you on sting and I don't need you on your own show to bring you down. I shall bring you down right where I'm crowned. I shall bring you down on social media, you rascal. Masa yoko balingria kapalingriene. Masikel yoko balingrio kopale. Surely, Daniel's God shall come forth and reveal to us the truth. Nothing else but the truth. So help us, O oh God. Vibes Cartel released. Let us see. And you tell me if you see Vibes Cartel. <laughs> Vibes Cartel released. This is the Vibes Cartel everybody was looking for. That Vibes Cartel. Right? But be honest and stop playing hypocrites. And be true to yourself. And stop let people play with your mentality. Stop being follow fashion. Everything people follow in a follow. In a have a mind of in a own. Wake up, Jamaica. Wake up. Jamaica, the man that you are going to his concert is not Vibes Cartel. <laughs> so, 
<laughs> Check this out. 13 years later, they released Vibes Cartel to us. Awa this, Yama. Awa this. Don't bother even tell him to take off the eyeglass. Because when you take off the eyeglass, I, I, I see thing where you don't even like fishy. And ladies and gentlemen, I am the last person to put down the sick. This is more than somebody sick. This is more than lizard mama obiami. No, ladies and gentlemen. You are looking at a totally different person that went through the trouble of getting the tattoos but didn't care a fuck about going further to fool you. Because this person is so confident. In other mind, them say, Jamaicans, them are done idiot. You can't sell them anything. I that them say no. I know me say that. Come and no say no smart. I me no say when me finish talk today. And I go sit down with you know, one another and say, but wait, Amari got a point. I said, this man felt that tattoo was enough to fool you and to fool me. And if you put a gap in between him teeth. <clears throat> take off the glasses, man. The other day, me tell you to take off the kerchief after you make so much people go buy it. You take off the kerchief, but you still not take off the glasses. You, do you want to tell people, sir, why you kept on the handkerchief? Because you have the same airline as the individual that you truly are. You only have to take off the kerchief if you them realize. But you still feel like, say, you fool the people. Masai Kopa Lakabalinglio. My friends, Vibes Cartel is a very tall man. I don't know who this is stump of frog here. I don't know who him. I don't know who him. I know this man. I don't know that the man did. The man stump her. The man have a big belly like a bullfrog. The man look like him older than Bop. The man look old. The man refused to get rid of the beard. That, that cartel was always clean shaved, ladies and gentlemen. You not go to jail and decide, say, you just have to start for wear a beard. You come out, you want to look young again. You want to feel young again. Eh? You not see how quick this bitch run in a studio. Come out and go in a studio, go do song. How kind of song that? This is a man who sat down and scribbled out the whole thing and make other people join with him with the intention and say, everybody are going to get rich. Is Joe Brakavish, Vakavish, Vakavish, is he guilty? Let's find out. Has he been fooled? Have they robbed from him millions? But him just have to go with it because it done gone bad. Him done sign contract. Was it that easy to fool a white man? Vibes cartel. My baby. My baby vibes cartel, ladies and gentlemen. I fought for him when he was in prison. And I fight for him once again. He come to me and he say, Amare. May I give you the torch for carry. Because all I ever wanted was for my body, my body to be transported throughout Jamaica and the people standing on the right. Look no, me know so some man don't like me, but me love you no still. But you no know, come on, no come on no my babies. Be honest no my babies. Come on, no tell me if that is the man that you're looking at. I've seen them. Being fooled. Have she given her love to a complete stranger? Have the people in St. Vincent and Panama 
have their rub upon a scavenger, a murderer. Eh? A murderer, I'm not talking about this vibes cartel. This vibes cartel that say time and time that he's innocent. But another murderer that murdered hundreds of people in Jamaica and was set free. Free by the government. Free by the government who lied and said that he died. Them seven turn over with him. Kevin Smith. Kevin Smith, you come again. And you fool the people of Jamaica and make them think say you are vibes cartel. Kevin Smith, you always wanted to be rich. Kevin Smith, you always wanted to be a superstar. Kevin Smith, you always want celebrity treatment. And you told the people that you're going to die and you're going to come back. And yes, you came back as Vibes Cartel. Yes, put in the comment section what you think about that. As you know, people, I am just a messenger. I'm not a prophet or prophet. So I want to put, like I said, in the comment section, if you're feeling what Amari is saying. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification button to be notified when I drop the latest. Bless.